we're here with another one of the six pack of peaks challenge in Oregon. This today we're climbing the Black Crater. It's uh, in the Three Sisters Wilderness. Um, as you can kind of see behind me, it's one of the areas that was really affected by that, that burn last year. So, but the word on the street is that once you get closer up to the uh, closer up to the top, it kind of clears up, and uh, there's actually some some unburned areas that are that are pretty beautiful. So, excited to get to the top and see what there is to see. through here it's kind of it looks depressing because it's so dead and everything's been been just scorched by this fire that that cut through here i just i think it's important to to comment on and to remember that these kind of disturbances are are, are actually natural in nature and that they're an, an important part of the ecosystem <sighs> these type of disturbances whether it be fire or bugs or tsunami or disease whatever but Abby that kills off kills off all these species like this it, it creates a gap in the ecosystem that's important for for pioneer species with wind-blown seedlings to actually get into these areas and be able to propagate and on top of that although the trees are dead we have a pretty vibrant seed bank in the ground which is all these all these seeds that have been dropped down and kind of buried and waiting for for the right amount of sunlight to hit that hadn't been hitting before because they've been overtopped. So these will sprout up and you can already see some of this green coming in, a lot of it's grasses, which is again, windblown seedlings. But more and more, you're gonna start seeing some of these pine seedlings and dug fir and noble fir seedlings start to pop back up. And that's, again, that's just a natural process. Oh, it looks ugly right now, but in 10 years, it's gonna look completely different. <laughs> How's it going? Doing good. Keep going. <laughs> oh, that's taking me by, by surprise. I didn't expect to see it this soon. That's that's got to be it. That's got to be the peak. There's no way that's a false on it. Oh, yeah, it's really starting to level out here. I figured it'd be on a straight peak, but. Uh, Got kind of a flat top up here. All right, let's get up to the top of that uh, that, that black outcropping up there and see uh, see what it's looking like. Some mountain out there. Oh, you can hardly see it in the in the distance over there. Whew. It's a little bit of a tough climb. Oh, gotta be careful where you put your feet up on this thing. Oh, all right. Oh man, those rocks are sharper than they look. <clears throat> This is, this is just better. <laughs> this is just better than I could have pictured it. I mean, look, you can just see full 360 view. Maybe I'll, I'll pan around here real quick so you can so you guys can see what I'm seeing. Cause it is just, I mean, amazing. I mean, there's gotta be 10 peaks that you can see from out here. I mean, <laughs> yeah, and there's a path we came up. Uh, you can see where it flattened out there, what I was talking about. 
Oh, looks like we beat that guy up. <laughs> oh, man. A couple more huge mounts. Those are a lot closer than the other ones. Oh, this is just so cool. This is so cool. You can see where it drops down over there. Maybe we'll walk over to that outcropping and see, uh, see if the view is any different over there. Well, here we are. Made it to the very top of Black Crater. It's quite a hike, not too bad. Mosquitoes weren't terrible this time, but man. The wind will get you up here. A little bit windy with all the trees burned out and blown down. No kind of cover, but man, let's just take a 360 here because this is just, this is gorgeous. This is just, I mean, definitely worth the hike. Full 360 view, big mountains off in the distance. Can't see any type of civilization out here. Other than that trail right there that we came in on, but that doesn't count. Yeah, this is it. Oh, wonderful hike. This is Black Crater, number two on the list of the six pack of peaks. Oh. Now, this fun part, now I gotta walk all the way down. 